Okay, my name is Buona. I'm going to be demonstrating the uh, Barrel Window Manager or whatever you want to call it. I got this on Ubuntu, uh, Ubuntu 6.1 and uh, this is running on an IBM ThinkPad T41 with 32 megabytes of video RAM. And this is a, not a very powerful card and it has an uh, ATI Mobility Radeon in it and I want to demonstrate some of Barrel's features. Uh, if you can see here I got the wobbly window effect working really good and uh, also got some other effects that I want to show off. I'm using the SVN edition so I have the new walls uh, feature which is similar to the um, the feature in Leopard I believe it's called Spaces and let me demonstrate that. As you can see I can see multiple desktops and I can move windows in between the desktops and still keep the wobbly effect with uh, very little slowdown and I have a couple of videos actually I have one video playing down here in uh, VLC and uh, accidentally paused it there as you can see it's working pretty good I can move this across desktops very easily and so on and so forth and uh, I'm going to go ahead and start another video over here and this may slow it down a little bit more And let me mute the sound so you can hear me talking. That's just a Justin Timberlake video. So, uh, and I got a web browser over here. It's a nice little effect there, and I can minimize this. Wobbly windows again, but it's a little less wobbly. You can see I'm starting to reach my limit a little bit. Close this window. Got the fire effect going there. Alright. Now the next thing I want to show is the ever popular cube effect. This is something you've probably seen on YouTube and all over the internet before. But I want to show you how it behaves on this uh, seemingly uh, low-end laptop. So I'm going to go to the Barrel Settings Manager. I'm going to go to Desktop. And I'm going to change it from Desktop Wall, which is what we were just doing, that emulates the uh, the spaces feature that's in uh, Mic OS 10 Leopard. And I'm going to switch over to Cube. It takes a little time to change a little bit. And uh, I'm also enabled the Rotate Cube feature so you can see that. If you haven't seen this yet, it's pretty cool. Okay. And I just disabled it again. <laughs> Impatience. All right. Okay, there we go. So now I got the rotating cube thing going on. As you can see, it's working pretty good. I'm not. Uh, I'm not doing a whole lot with it. I mean, I'm not doing a whole lot on this machine, but this this thing has a 32 megabyte video card, and uh, it's able to do all of this fairly easily. I mean, I'm not, I haven't tweaked a whole lot. I mean, I disabled some of the features, but uh, as you can see, it it works pretty good. And I can drag windows across the cube like so. Let me go ahead and play that while I do it. Video still playing without a hitch, so that's pretty nice, right? So that's Barrel, and uh, just want to give you a show of it. If anybody wants to see anything else, I'll see what I can do. And uh, go visit my site at Buona.org if you want any more information regarding this stuff. I'll have links up there. Toodles.